Good morning and time now for that most accurate forecast as we talk about those temperatures heating back up. We managed to stay just shy of that 110 mark yesterday. So we didn't add to this ongoing count of days with highs at 110 degrees or hotter. So far that count for the year at 26 days. The average in a single year, 21 days. We're already past that. The all time record was set just last year when we had 55 days. Luckily, we aren't seeing as many so far this year, but we are going to start adding to that count again today as temperatures get a little bit hotter. Phoenix stops out at 100. 12 this afternoon. Hotter to our west too. Bullhead City and Lake Havasu approaching that 115 mark this afternoon. Triple digit heat in Sedona and in Page with temperatures in the upper 80s to low 90s from the Grand Canyon to Flagstaff, Heber and Sholo, Window Rock as well. That heat risk is in the moderate range. Certainly don't let your guard down. This heat can be dangerous. Make sure that you're still limiting your time outside and taking appropriate heat safety precautions. But as you watch me fast forward through the week, you're going to start to see that heat risk climb by Friday and Saturday specifically into that major, maybe even extreme extreme range for parts of Arizona, including right here in the valley. That means that risk for heat illness and heat exhaustion, heat stroke, all of that is going up and we could see more impacts to industries and infrastructure that is heat sensitive as these temperatures climb. So because of that, we're going to see new heat alerts towards the end of the week too. Now today, look for a high of 112. We're up to 114 on Thursday. Then we go as high as 115, maybe even 116 by Friday and Saturday. Temperatures then come down a bit, but not by much. Still at 110 plus Sunday and early next week. Because because of that increasing risk for heat illness, we are going to be under heat alerts by the end of the week. Right now, there are excessive heat watches. They were just issued overnight. They will likely be upgraded to excessive heat warnings within the next 24 to 36 hours. You'll notice that heat alert is for the valley, central Arizona, and much of southwest Arizona, too. It'll be Friday through Saturday for spots like Phoenix and Yuma. For areas along the lower Colorado River Valley, spots like Parker, that alert will be in effect from Friday through Sunday. And for northwest Arizona, areas like Bull Head City and Lake Havasu, you'll be under that heat warning or rather heat watch now that will likely be upgraded to a warning from Friday to Sunday as well as again, those temperatures get dangerously hot. We're also going to be back to dealing with air quality alerts, especially Thursday and Friday with ozone high pollution watches that will likely be upgraded to advisories here Thursday and Friday. So temperatures topping 110 today, closer to 115 Thursday and Friday, 116 by Saturday. Today, a quieter day in the valley, but storm chances are back starting tomorrow.